it's week 10 and it's time to really crank up the fat burning intensity. The sun is really bright. So this week I'm following my workout plan and I'm getting a strict diet plan put together so that I really burn this fat and get fit and then hopefully you can take some of the ideas and tips that I'm doing and apply them to your own weight loss journey. Now if you do like this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up or comment down below let me know and of course hit the subscribe button so you join me Josie on my journey from fat to fit. Now, what did I get up to this week? So, right, so today is Monday, which means it's 10 minute workout day. And I was trying to come up with things that I could do. And then I saw this post about wall workouts. So I'm gonna do a 10 minute hit wall workout using the wall as our prop, if you like, or apparatus. Um, to support and it works your abs, your arms and your legs so it's a bit of a full body and it's 10 minutes long so what's not to like? Here we go. tastes so much nicer after a workout when you're really gasping a thirst. That was surprisingly difficult considering you know the moves were pretty much what I've been doing but by using the wall somehow it really ups the intensity like the mountain climbers using the wall oh my god that was a real killer. For 10 minutes I'm sweating and I've worked hard so I will definitely do a wall workout again. I threw a couple of extra moves in with the lunges at the end just because I wanted to try it out. So um, yeah, I hope you like it. And if you try it, comment below, let me know how you got on. So today for my lunch, I'm having this gorgeous healthy egg salad. And this is how I made it.
I'm going to do a totally tone Tabata workout. Do 20 seconds on, 10 second rest, four rounds and about 10 different exercises. You repeat each round three times. Oh my God. Maybe I've bitten off more than I can chew, but I will attempt to do as much as I can. So here it is, totally tone Tabata workout. So this morning for breakfast I thought I would try something different and step away from my usual overnight oats that I keep going on about and I've made my own chocolate and peanut butter protein porridge. Now I've tried ready done brands of protein porridge and yeah they taste nice but they're so expensive. Porridge oats are really cheap to buy and all I can fathom is they're putting protein powder in them. So why are they so expensive? So I thought I would make my own version. So this is my chocolate peanut butter protein porridge. And this is how I made it. So I've got half a cup of overnight oats or 50 grams. 100 grams of milk of your choice. It could be a nut milk, oat milk. Um, skim milk that's what I've got but you can use whatever milk you prefer and I've got two scoops or 12 grams of chocolate protein powder now I'm using protein world uh, protein powder just because I prefer it but you can use whatever one you like and this is just a little bit of crunchy cereal with chocolate flakes in um, this is obviously optional I'm using this 100% nuts crunchy peanut butter made with no added salt or sugar and no palm oil. So that was week 10 of my weight loss journey. I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe so you join me, Josie and Mabel on my weight loss journey from fat to fit. Hopefully it's given you some motivation and ideas that you can apply to your own weight loss journey. If that's the case, please let me know. Comment down below because I'd love to hear from you. Now that's the end of this vlog. So I will see you next Friday for my next week's upload. Take care.